Hi there, it's been quite a while since I posted my last video uh, but it's been just too cold in the workshop and uh, to be honest it's just not pleasant in uh, these these temperatures. Um, now I had started uh, making the crankshaft quite a few weeks ago uh, but then I realised that the material that had uh, been sold to me um, wasn't the right material so I need to start that from scratch again. So hopefully I'll be able to cover that in my next video. Um, but in the meantime, I thought I'd treat myself and I, I just couldn't resist uh, buying a little BS, BSA Bantam motorbike. Um, I messed around with them when I was a kid and uh, I thought it'd be nice to sort of try and get hold of a, a decent one. And uh, I've managed to get hold of a, a 1971 model, one of the last Bantams to be made. And it was made... Um, in a batch of uh, one or two hundred I think for the uh, general post office at the time and uh, it's got fairly low mileage on it and uh, it looks in really good nick um, unfortunately I can't um, well I've not got a motorcycle license I can I can sort of ride them <laughs> but not legally on the road um, so I need to decide what I'm going to do maybe I'll set myself a challenge of trying to get um, a license to run it on the road or alternatively, um, I suppose I could uh, get a little trailer and uh, take it around uh, various venues. But we'll have to see. Uh, but anyway, I'll uh, show you some brief clips of it. So uh, I hope you uh, like the little motorbike and uh, hopefully it won't be too long until I get my next uh, machining video out. So uh, in the meantime, um, all the best to everybody and uh, I hope to see you later. <laughs> 